Hello everybody, welcome back to our 374 channel. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how to fix the low volume problem on your Samsung Galaxy Tab Active 5 Pro. So what you guys want to do is go over to the settings first. Now here in the settings, we wanna adjust the media and the call volume. So go over to sound and vibration. Now select volume. And right here, you can adjust the media volume. You can also adjust the call volume here. And you can only do that while being on a call with somebody. But here you guys can adjust the media volume for an example. As you guys can see, it's playing, it's definitely working. So now let's go back here. And then what we wanna do next is disable the not disturb mode if it's enabled. So let's go over to notifications. Now in the notifications we will have do not disturb and make sure that it is disabled because it will mute all calls, notifications and every single alert except for those that you allow. So you guys can allow during do not disturb here you guys can select everything and I would recommend disabling it because it also can cause the low volume problem to be on your device. Now after that what you guys can do is clean the speaker grooves so as you guys can see we have them right here and right here now we want to clean them using a soft brush for an example it does its job very good now the next one is the air compressor but i would recommend using the soft brush now what you guys can do as a last resort is update your software to fix any audio glitches that may be on your device so scroll down in the settings all the way down until you see software update now click it and click on download and install as you guys can see it will check for updates automatically and i'm running the latest version of the one ui and the android we have the 7.0 and the android 15 so that's good our security patch is from september now if you haven't updated your software in a while then i would recommend to do so because it's very important to stay on the latest version it has less glitches than the older ones and that's basically what you guys need to do it should take about 15 to 20 minutes for just an update and install but it will take up to one hour if your internet connection is bad so that's it for the video i hope it was helpful if it was then leave a like subscription and a comment and i'll see you in the next one bye